Welcome back to Let's Play Persona 3 Portable. Last we left off, not much got done other than uh, Nozomi getting mad at us and storming off. So hopefully something of note gets done this episode. Alright, let's see. Um, oh yeah, they said something about the typhoon. Oh, dang, Yukari looks... Uh, bruh, bruh, Yukari looks just so done in, oh, in her model over there. Okay, um, I'm not going to go to Tartarus tonight, so what I am going to do is I'm going to study some more. Alright, awesome. Friday. You overhear a conversation. Hey, have you been to the film festival yet? That theater by the station is hosting it, right? I lost, out, I lost count of how often I went there over summer break. I hear there's going to be another festival on the 23rd. Wanna go? Nah, I'll pass on this one. I forget what this one's theme is, but I remember it was all kitty. <laughs> yeah, alright, so let's look at let's be on the lookout for the theater on the for the um Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, we got caught out in the typhoon. Oh. You weren't quick enough, huh? According to the news, a typhoon just hit. Supposedly it's the biggest one on record. It's moving slowly too, so it'll be around for a while. Yeah, thanks to that the school festival got canned. <laughs> Setting all that stuff up is a pain. So I don't mind, but it sucks that we'll be stuck indoors. So, how are you gonna spend your break? So, you're a slacker after all, huh? What about you, Fuka? Me? Well, the only thing I plan to do is go to the movies. Ooh, a movie. Is it a date? It's... it's not like that. I'm going with Natsuki-chan. She absolutely loves movies. But with this typhoon, I don't know if we'll be able to go. How about you, Yukatan? Will you still have practice? I doubt it. The archery range is outside, so it's most likely cancelled until the storm blows over. Same here. This stupid typhoon is gonna mess up my training. What about you, Senpai? I haven't decided. Besides, what business is it of yours, Iori? Me? Well, I'd be happy to tell you about my plans. I suspect that you will be visiting Chidori-san. Although she has stabilized, we cannot release her. Man, Aichan, you must be psychic. And you know what? She wants me to come. Not to brag or anything. I, uh, just thought I should check up on her. You know, with the storm and all. Is that so? What's up with him? Um, well... You don't know either? Oh, yeah. Ken-kun, what are you going to do during the break? Oh, nothing in particular. Come on, you have to be doing something. Well, I'll probably go visit the shrine. Dude, you're a kid, not an old man. But that's where I always go. I guess you could say I made a vow. Anyway, I'm going back to my room. I have a lot of homework to do. Oh, okay. Well, call me if you get stuck. Okay, so that was interesting. So it looks like during break, uh, oh, whoa, 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 my mic just fell. So it looks like during break, uh, everyone's, uh, everyone's plans got canceled because of this typhoon. Uh, <laughs> so anyway, uh, let's hear everyone's thoughts. This building was damaged by, uh, was damaged by that shadow back in April. I wonder if there are any leaks in it. I hope this building uh, didn't get damaged as badly as my ribs. Dang. Due to the cancellation of the festival, we will receive five days off from school. We will have the weekend off. The 21st is Respect for the Age Day. The 22nd is a national holiday. The 23rd is the um, Autumnal uh, Equinox. We should spend this time wisely. That we should. I hate to say this, but I'm so happy the festival got canceled. I mean, come on, a maid outfit? I'd rather stand inside. I mean, stand outside in the middle of a typhoon than have to wear a maid outfit. And I can't say I blame her, you know? Not everyone's too on board with, with stuff like that. We can't see Yucatan in a maid outfit now because the festival was canceled. Bummer, huh? Uh, what I, Oh, no. I know, right? I bet all the other guys are bummed out about this, too. Jesus. Come on, Junpei. As student council president, I am, ha I am saddened to hear the festival has been canceled. I suggested that the date be rescheduled, but it seems that won't happen. 
Well, there is nothing one can do to hinder, uh, to hinder Mother Nature's will. You're all wet. Are you all right? You don't look so good. I don't think you should go to Tartar. You think? There's a, there's a typhoon outside. Uh, I don't think anyone wants to go to Tartarus in all this wind and rain anyway. Yeah, like I said, um, in this part of Virginia that I live in, uh, we do get hurricanes, but like, um, the worst that a hurricane will do here in the Hampton Roads of Virginia is that it'll just, um, like, a few trees will get thrown around and, like, the flooding will go up to probably just up to your ankles and then, like, just disappear afterwards. Nothing too dramatic. Making a wish. <laughs> Why can't he act like a normal kid? Alright. Your body is cold all over and you come down with an illness. You're incredibly sleepy. You fall asleep as soon as your head hits the pillow. I forgot to save, too, didn't I? Hey, is that... is that, um... Oh. Okay, huh. Is this a cutscene? I have been waiting for you. I last summoned you in your dreams quite some time ago. Several seasons have come and gone since I first offered my assistance. Now then. Your special power, Persona. Have you been using it wisely? Therefore, please allow me to provide you with a new form of assistance. Henceforth, you shall be able to fuse four or more Personas. I am certain that this will be of great benefit to you. But now, you must be tired. Please, rest easy. Until we meet again, farewell. Okay, so um, we now ha we are finally able to perform quad uh, quad fusion. Okay, so this is the best form of fusion because um, with quad fusion you can fuse four, as the name implies, you can f fuse four or more personas and create something really good or just really terrible. And with quad fusion, you know, you can also fuse your social link personas, like say Thor for the chariot. Um, no, I think it was Odin for the chariot persona. No, it was Thor. Anyway. We had also been sleep for two di uh, two consecutive days, too. The physical t condition is, of a fighter is very important. No matter how strong you are, if you don't feel well, you won't last long in the ring. Oh, you seem to be feeling better. Why don't you go get some fresh air? It's really nice out. You feeling okay, Senpai? You should take you should take today to rest. Matter of fact, how am I feeling? Status. Uh. Oh. Okay. All right. So I'm good. Awesome. Arf. <laughs> I, I, I don't know why I clicked on it expecting him to say something. Probably because I thought I guess was going to translate for him, but whatever. They say idiots never get sick. Oh wait, that means since you got sick, you're smart. And since I didn't, I'm an... Well, well you know, what did they know anyways? I'm glad you're feeling better now, but don't be careless or you might get sick again. Hey, uh, could the cursor hover over to... There we go, I guess. Good morning. I am here to monitor the condition of your health. Your temperature, pulse, and breathing have all returned to normal. Congratulations on surviving your illness. Oh my god. <laughs> she said surviving. And this game takes place in 2009. Um, in 2009, I know the, the swine flu was going around too. I remember that. Um, that was a huge thing. There was like a huge panic over that. But like, coronavirus was like, way, like had a way worse panic now than swine flu ever did. Okay, I feel fine now. But then let's explore Tart. Come on, dude. Come on, uh, Mitsuru. Uh, it's only been like a day's. I like. I just gotten up. Come on, Mitsuru. Called a little cold, huh? Glad to see you're feeling better. All right. Uh, let's head out. Let's head out to. Uh, let's. I want to try out the shrine. Is Maiko gonna be there? Okay. Finally, it's been a while. Oh no, poor thing. Poor Maiko. I can't handle it anymore. Mom and Dad just keep fighting. I yelled at them so much to stop, to please stop fighting so much. But they told me to leave them alone. So I made up my mind. I have to run away from home. Calm down. 
You're right, this is no time to be selfish. But I made up my mind, and I'm going to run away. I'd better start packing soon. So, what do you think I need to pack if I'm running away from home? I'll need lots of snacks, right? What about my health insurance card? It'll take more than that. But I don't know what else I should bring. Okay, what else? Maybe my PJs and my toothbrush? Uh, what else? Either way, I'm going to try. Don't worry, I'm going to be just fine, okay? I'm gonna miss you, though. It won't be easy to be alone. Oh, oh my god, this poor thing. The girl at the shrine reached level 6. Once I run away, Mom and Dad will have to work together to find me. This is gonna be great. It takes a lot of hard work to get ready to run away. Oh my god. I don't even know... Okay, he just... Alright. Okay, then. Hey, my controller... Hey! Hey, my controller sucks now! <laughs> Hold on. And, uh... OBS... Okay, there we go. OBS was acting funny. Okay. My controller was acting funny. I don't know what that was. Okay. Alright. While you were resting, a typhoon pet. What'd you say? While you were resting, a typhoon passed through town. Not much damage was incurred. There is nothing else to report. Dude, that typhoon was crazy. Everything was flying through the air. Well, n not everything, I guess. I mean, I didn't see a ramen stand uh, flying through the air. Oh, I wish I could have seen that. Oh, that's right. I should have made you some chicken noodle soup for your cold. Sorry I didn't think about it sooner. Next time you get sick, remind me. Aw, thanks, Yukari. I'm glad you weren't sick for very long. It's most likely because you rested for two days straight. How are you feeling? I feel fine now. Then let's explore. Yeah, Mitsuru, like that, like it's it's way too soon. Like the dude is just getting off from like being sweet uh, for several days on end. Now you want him to explore Tartarus? Okay, they're saying the same things right here. That was a pretty big typhoon. I bet a lot of buildings were destroyed. Yukari-san and Fukasan were really scared during it. Were you scared during it, James? I slept right through it. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to explore Tartarus. Alright. Everyone's status? Everyone is able to go. Nice. Let's head out to Tartarus. I'm thinking of making these epi episodes a bit longer now because that last episode, um... Yeah, that last episode was... Uh, nothing much happened there. And I don't want to make like 30 minute episodes where nothing happened, so I might increase the run time. Well, I'm going to keep the run time at either 40 or 50 minutes long. And if it's a full moon boss, it's going to be more than an hour long. And for the finale, I'm going to make it a two hour special. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. I, I meant to pick Yukari. Alright, we're, again, we're going with the usual team Yukari, I guess, and, uh,. And Akihiko. I almost forgot Akihiko's name for a second. <laughs> I also forgot to I also forgot to Google a fusion guide so I can get the uh, so I can get the full social link personas. Alright. I'm gonna look up a social link after I like do a cut or something. Alright, we're still Oh, we have to fight this guy, don't we? Oh Alright, so what are we up against? Oh, okay, so it's three tanks, and I should have Mazio. So let me equip uh, Takemi Kazuchi. Oh no, I'm in the wrong menu. Uh, where's it? Persona. Alright, let's do this. Good luck. This is no ordinary enemy. Don't let your guard down. Alright, so uh, we're fighting these three tanks. If I remember correctly, these guys are weak to lightning. So, uh, but first, let me let me apply let me apply a buff real quick. All right, I hope. Oh, already in effect. Okay, so it's auto tower Kaja. Nice. Ooh, nasty hit. All right, Yukari needs to get better armor, so I'm gonna go shot for some after. Uh oh. He doesn't seem to work on it. All right, electricity doesn't work on these guys. I got excited for nothing. Okay, these guys are probably, uh, these guys probably are not weak to physical attacks, but it doesn't hurt to try. 
Oh, never mind. And he knows mine charge. Great. All right, do they are they weak to my my All right, so they're not. I don't think they're weak to anything. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Okay, okay. Um, how do I get myself out of this situation? This is not looking good. Let me switch back to Sati. I didn't even. Uh, I also don't think I got a good look at what what they're capable of too. All right, so I'm gonna be using lots of uh, lots of level two healing spells. So I have like Snuff Soul ready. This is not good. All right, ooh, all right. Everyone's gonna need to be on guard. Oh yeah, everyone's definitely gonna need to be on guard, including I guess too, even though she can stand up to physical attacks. Oh my God. Oh, that's hey, bro. Not cool. Not cool. You can't. Okay. Let's try this again. And he knows Zyodyne, nice! <laughs> this is not good, I should've- Oh god, I regret not grinding now. Oh man. Look, I think it's the only one that didn't even, uh, that didn't even take a terrible hit like that. Wait, are we still running Tarukage? Alright, I ran down a quarter of their helm, too. Yukari, this would be a, a good time to learn Meteorama or something. Oh man, I probably should have grinded her um, to learn Meteorama. Well, it's too late now. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Alright, that's why we have Sati here to heal us up. Oh no. <laughs> the, my, the, odds are, the odds are clearly not in my favor. Okay, I need to get Rakukaja. I also need to get Sekunda on too as well. All right, one thing at a time, though. All right, so these guys are not weak to, uh... These guys can block out lightning completely, is what I meant to say. Okay. It's our... Dude. All right. Yeah, they still weakened our defenses, so I... Um, if that hit was, um... If that guy had used something like Zeodyne or something, that this fight would have been over. Oh, right, he's going in for mine charge. All right, all right, I need to guard up. First thing I need to do is uh, use media on everyone, and then I'm gonna, and then I'm gonna go in and uh, wait for them to use whatever he's about to use. I know, Cause this is gonna be a huge hit. I need to be ready, and I'm gonna also top that off with media Rama. Although I'm not guarding, so that's a huge risk I'm putting myself in, which is probably why I should have used. Uh, uh, probably why I should have used, uh, not used, should have grinded Yukari for uh, media Rama. All right, I will be back. Give me a moment. Okay, I am back. Alright, so you guys remember the other, uh, a few videos ago, or our last video, when I used a, um, Hanuman? So it turns out he knows Gale Slash, so I'm finally putting it to use, and, um, if you use Gale Slash along with, Ma uh, Mataru Kaja, you have a recipe for, yeah. So he deals a decent amount of damage, it's, uh oh. That happened. This dude, dang, they are slaughtering everyone! Oh my god. Probably because I didn't guard up one time. Um, you know, I'm gonna use... Alright, when it comes my turn, I'm going to use one of those, um... One of those things I bought from the jewel shop. Let me see. Where's Revival Beat at? Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's use Recom on... I'm sorry. Matter of fact, they're probably gonna destroy us, too. Yeah, this is a bad idea. Oh no. Alright, I don't know what that third tank is gonna do. Oh! Oh my god, thank you. I can't. Oh my god. I. Oh man. I guess. Thank you, I guess. I was. I was. I actually had my finger hovered over the stop recording button the second I died. Oh my god. Thanks, I guess. You, I guess. I guess is clutch, man. That was awesome. Defense weakened. Please be careful. Okay. Oh man. Oh man. All right. Let's get everyone healed up first of all. Oh man. I'm still. Uh, I'm still. I'm still at a loss for words right now because of what. Uh, because of what just happened. Oh my God. I need to. I need to take a moment. Uh, I. <laughs> I guess just scared me. Like, bruh. Okay. All right. Let's get back to fighting. Thank you, I guess. Oh, you know, I'm not even gonna. Hold on. Let me heal everyone up using that Meteorama first. 
So yeah, that's Hanuman. I'm gonna start using him uh, as one of my main personas from now on. Yeah, uh, I'm also gonna, and also later on in this video, I'm going to try to use a uh, quad fusion and see what I can come up with. Since I maxed out a few of the social links, and I can also pull up a, uh, a guide online too. Uh, this dude's gonna Thanos one of us. And since I'm, since I have the lowest health right now, he's probably gonna come after me. Hey, a critical hit. Oh dang, that doesn't get you another turn? Uh, I, I thought that when an enemy missed you and they fell on their feet, they, I mean fell off their feet, they would, um, it would count, um, you would get an extra turn if you landed a crit on them. I guess not. Ah, uh, good to know, I guess. Alright, let me, let me get my health back. And I also need to use a Snuff Soul as well. Alright, let me use, it's, yeah, I'm gonna use a Chewing, no, 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 uh, that's only for emergencies. Yeah, let's use a Snuff Soul right now. I don't need that much, um, I don't need that much magic, but still. Magic is important. You know, the way the camera's positioned, I really think that... I, I'm really paranoid that he's about... Oh my god, bro. And then he's gonna double down and hit Igus again. Like, bro. Like, you couldn't have got... You couldn't have taken out your car. You had to hit Igus, I guess. Okay. Let's try this again. That's, that's like, what? Three KOs this fight? Four? I lost count. Oh man, this is ridiculous. I, all right, I really want this fight to end now. It's, oh, oh, oh! I, yeah, I set it down on. Yeah, I mean, didn't mean to. I set it down on my lap. I didn't mean to hit L two. Okay. All right. Um, let's. You know what? Since I want this fight to end faster, I'm going to use Mataru Kaja, so I can. Uh, so everyone's attack is increased, and they have a better chance of lowering the enemy's health uh, faster, especially with I guess using using Swift Strike. You know, I'm gonna be honest, I'm really, really glad that you cannot stack, um... I'm really glad that you can't stack attack buffs in this game. Oh no. Bruh. No! Oh. Bruh. Oh my god, what? Yo, how are y'all gonna die? Bruh. The one time they get a critical hit on me, they decide, hey, let's gang up on the main character. We already know that if he dies, I mean, that the game it's a game over when he gets knocked out. So let's gang up on the main character. I've also hated that, not only that, but I also hated that as a, I also hate that in JRPGs as a feature, not a feature, as a, um, as like something, uh, as a gameplay thing or whatever. I can't find the right words. I, I hate that it's in JRPG gameplay to this day. Like in Persona 5, if you get knocked out, the game's over. Like, like the party doesn't know not to like keep Joker safe until the fight's over. I don't know. Like Shin Megami Tensei 4 did it best when um whenever uh, what was his name Flynn? Yeah, whenever Flynn gets knocked out, the, his demons will continue the fight no matter what. I don't know, man. All right, I'm gonna bring it back. All right, g give me a few minutes. Okay, I'm back. This, this fight is almost over, but I also, for the first time in this playthrough, you guys get to be to see me do something that I haven't done. I I don't think I've ever done this ever. So yeah, I'm going to use Cadenza. Yes, Cadenza. Okay, so I've used Cadenza, and yeah, this what Cadenza does is that it increases your um. Not only does it give you 50% of your health back, but it also increases your uh, evasion rate. Okay. Oh man, this sucks. Okay. Um, this fight's almost over, but I shouldn't get too cocky. Watch out, because one of them might pull out a critical hit. And let's deal. We're gonna deal with the one that knows that has power charge. And it also turns out that Yukari, um, her wind attacks are very powerful. Watch this. Yeah, it does way more than Igus' uh, Swift Strike. Probably because it, uh, Swift Strike does light damage, but still. Pretty nice. Alright, by, oh, by the way, you won't believe what I went through just to get to this point. It, um, I, the game wasted... Okay, so this is what sucked. The game forced Akihiko, Yukari, and uh, Igus... All of, it wasted all of their self-sacrifices, which means they can only use it once per fight. And after they use those chances to um, save me from fatal attacks, that means I will automatically die from fatal attacks by default. And the game knows this, which is why they try to attack me, why they try to use big attacks against me. 
Alright, let's use Garuda. This fight's over. This fight pissed me off. There we go. 112? Now, if you can't use Magaruwa, then yeah. This fight would have been really fast. Oh man, we need Yukari to learn uh, Meteorama. All right, let's go and let's go and get the two treasures on this floor. I know they're somewhere. If they don't give me treasure after that, I'm going to be mad. Balm of Life, nice. Yeah, those things are incredibly rare. Nice to have those. Oh, I shouldn't have gone up. What was I thinking? Oh no, I might have to fight them again if it um. And push comes to shove. All right, let's see what these. Well, this is gonna. This presents us with a with a chance to see what these new enemies are like. And uh, they. Okay. Well, that sucks. Um, we don't know what they're like because um, these enemies I've already fought many times before to a point where um, Fuka can scan them. So let's just use Mudo and deal with them. Hey, for once, Mudo landed. Okay, I already have Mothman. Speaking of Mothman, I was watching a, um, so last night I was watching uh, a BuzzFeed, um, it was called, it was called BuzzFeed Unsolved Mysteries, whatever it's called, no, BuzzFeed Unsolved. Anyways, um, so on this episode of BuzzFeed Unsolved, they, what they did was they went to the city, not city, the town of Point Pleasant, West Virginia, so they could crack open the mystery of Mothman and what he's like, oh, oh, he didn't even detect me. Anyway, it yeah, so the town of Point Pleasant, West Virginia has, like, this huge culture surrounding Mothman. And I, <laughs> I gotta say, that's pretty dope that their town is based off of myth. I remember one of the hosts, I think it was either Shane or Ryan. I think Shane said something about the town purposefully making up Mothman just so they can have, uh, drive, um, just so they can drive tourism to the town and, you know, have, it, um, have their economy... Matter of fact, their economy is based off of Mothman. In the same way how um, the city of Cleveland, Ohio, is their economy is based off of um, LeBron James. <laughs> well, yeah, it's pretty interesting. You guys should watch it. I might leave a link to it below. And watch it. And watch a few other BuzzFeed Unsolved episodes. They're pretty. They're pretty interesting. I'm more of a fan of uh, BuzzFeed Unsolved uh, True Crime than I am a fan of BuzzFeed Supernatural. And I want to see. I want to see them uh, do like a unsolved, um, more unsolved sports mysteries. I don't know. That season only had like a few episodes. Um, it had the one with Muhammad Ali. It had one with LeBron James with his. Uh, no, I said LeBron James. I, I, I meant to say Michael Jordan. I don't know why I said LeBron James. It had one with uh, Michael Jordan, and they also had another episode with um, with the when the New England Patriots got caught in that scandal. Um, what was it? It was the Flight Gate. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I'm going on about sports and, uh, while I'm um, while I'm playing a Japanese role playing game, but still, it's interesting. And on the topic of sports, I'm a, you guys may or may not know it, but yeah, I'm a huge Washington Nationals fan as well. Yeah, I, I, like I said, I really wish that season of BuzzFeed Unsolved uh, Sports Mysteries went on um, to get more episodes. I understand that not everyone's into sports, but still, it would have been, I really would have loved to see more, more stuff like that. I love reading about, I love reading about, you know, behind the scenes, uh, you know, behind the scenes diaries of what goes on when it comes to sports. Especially when it comes to stuff like wrestling, that is really interesting. Okay, um... These, all right, let's use Mamudo. It's probably not going to land, or it's probably going to land, land on one dude. We'll, we'll have to see. All right, let's rush him. Damn! Uh, okay, I just stabbed the dude. Uh, dude, uh, nice. I already have virtue, so let's go pick up this money. Speaking of money, how much do I have? 9,000. All right, that's over 9,000 yen. Nice. All right, 132,000 yen. Okay, so I'm going to go hit up the... Uh, that one store in Polonia Mall after this. Alright, I think we're done here for tonight, so let's go home. But no, there's another shadow. Hey, are these guys... Oh no, I fought these guys before. It's weak against... Oh, it's... Alright, it's weak against fire. Let's use wind against it first. And then we're gonna use fire. Oh, wait, this guy... Oh, I forgot that they block wind. <laughs> oh no, why'd I do that? Uh-oh. Oops. Okay, um... What I meant to do was, I meant to use fire against him, and nobody on the team knows fire, with the exception of Junpei and, um... With the exception of Junpei and Koromaru. Oh my god. I did not... Oh, I was not thinking. Especially with the one dude that, know, um, that knows Heat Wave. 
Alright, he got knocked out. Alright, I hope he gets dizzy after this. Oh, he doesn't. Alright, so I have to use uh, Garu on him. Alright, let's use Diorama. I can sense that something's gonna go wrong, so I'm gonna use Diorama just in case. Alright, uh... You know, let's, you know, let's use Garu uh, on him just so he doesn't get back up in the next turn. Oh, never mind. Okay, so we just need to use Sati and have her use uh, Miragi on them. And this fight will be over and we can return to the dorm. Dang, so either he was asleep for like several consecutive days, or he was just, or he would probably... I have a feeling that maybe he was just in... Oh, no. Okay, all right. The emulator is acting up. I have a feeling he was either asleep for several days, or he was just, like, he was awake at times, and, you know, he stepped downstairs every once in a while just to get some food. And that's what I feel like. All right, lean and seed. All right, we have a lot of money, and we have lots of good fusion. So before we leave the, before we leave Tartarus, let's hit up the Velvet Room real quick and see what we can get out of a quad fusion. And uh, if I do, and I forgot that to look up a fusion guide for, um, for the social link personas. So, yeah. All right, let's register. The, yeah, we need to register these guys first. All right, register all of them, please. Yeah, I like to register like even if I don't need to, just in case. Just to be safe. Alright. Oh, you can also use a cross fusion and a pentagon fusion. Alright, so I think pentagon fusions are used for, um... I think pentagon fusions are used for, like, the social link personas. Alright. Oh, nice! We don't even have to... Nice. Hey, I can fuse Alice! Okay, so these ones are easy to summon. You know what? Let's get Alice. We need a Lilim, Pixie, Natataishi, and a Narcissist. I have all of those in the compendium. I hope so. Okay, Persona Compendium, let's go by name. Oh, I can't, I mean, alright, let's see, Nata Taishi, where is he? I remember using him in many videos ago. I don't think he's registered. Okay, so, ba uh, bad news, no Alice this playthrough. This sucks, um, I really wanted to fuse Alice, but I guess, alright, what about, what if we use a Pentagon fusion? Oh, oh, I, uh, I hit, oops, alright. So I want to do Pentagon Fusion. I can summon Daisoju, uh, Daisoju, Lucifer, oh, you can summon, I can summon Lucifer. F but all, a lot of these personas are very difficult to obtain, especially Satan and uh, Abaddon and Sam, and Beelzebub. I think I have them in one of my old saves. And Mara, oh no, Mara. All right. Okay, so... All right, we've done all we could here in Tartarus. I'm gonna climb a few more floors the day after. All right, so let's leave Tartarus and yeah. Oh yeah, this is one of our days off too. Hey, someone got stuck in Tartarus again, didn't they? Every time I, I say, hey, I wanna go out, uh, I wanna chill tonight. Uh, Elizabeth Call saying, yo, someone got stuck in Tartarus. Alright, two humans, too. Hey, a social link calling me. That's messed up. I'm ca I'm dehumanizing my- <laughs> I'm dehumanizing my friends by calling them social links. That's so messed up. Hi, it's Yuko. Alright, let's do something. Let's accept the offer. Might as well. You can have mine if you're still hungry. Yuko is not eating as much as usual. D don't worry, I'm not sick or anything. Yuko's face just turned red. James, you have some sauce on your mouth. Thank you. You're welcome. Aren't you gonna wipe it off? It's bugging me. Today you learned something new about- What did I learn? You recall that you have something- Oh, no. I don't even- Alright, alright, alright. What does Yuko like? A Jack Frost doll. Nice. Uh, flowers, fashion- Fuck it. Um. Nah, I'm I'm not even gonna give her uh, give her a gift. Oh man, I also need to look up a social link gift guide as well. All right, so we have to go to talk to Fuka. How are you feeling? Okay. All right, and it's the same thing as before. 
All right, uh, probably on the second or third floor hallway. Oh, uh, no, I got it wrong. It's the second floor hallway. There they are. They're just chilling up here. All right, everyone can go tonight, and yeah. All right, okay, so... Great, so I need to find um, two people that strayed into Tartarus. All right, let's check out what floor they got stuck in. I hope the floors aren't, like, on block four. 130 and 135. And what floor are we on? Hold on a second. Oh, no. That's way ahead, isn't it? Oh, no. This is going to take a long time to do. Okay. I'm going to cut this part out. I'm also going to be listening to, like, a someone... I'm also going to be listening to a podcast while I try to get to, um, get to these floors. So, I'll, I'll be back. Wow, that, uh, that took a long time. Okay. Finally, uh, <laughs> Yo, okay, so we're finally on the floor where the missing person is at. Matter of fact, let me use, uh, Meteorama. Oh yeah, one more thing, um, speaking of Meteorama, I actually leveled up, uh, while I was grinding on my way up to this specific floor, I also managed to, uh, get Yukari, she's... Yukari is now level 40, which means she's three more levels away from learning, uh, from learning Meteorama. So, it's looking pretty good. Yeah, I've noticed how, um, I also got to listen to, um, some of the song, I mean, some of this track right here. And I also noticed that this, like I said before, this song is very, very somber. Yeah, might as well rush him. Yeah, this guy is, a uh, pretty easy to, to fight against. He's, uh, he's weak against strike attacks, which means you can send Akihiko or Agus to go to work on him, and... But he gives away, like, very little experience points. Yeah, I see the person. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, uh, oh, I ran into these guys before. I don't think I have an ice attack. Yeah, I don't know. Uh-oh. Oh, no. No, we've come too far. <laughs> no, we've come too far to die. Uh, no. We have come too far. Not only that, but I'm also scared that uh, I also don't know if this is randomized either. Because, like, one moment he's on 4134, 134, and then next you know, he's like on 4150. Not 4150, um, but like some other floor. I don't want to do this all again. No. Are these guys with the fire? Yeah, um, if I recall, hold on. Yeah, these guys have to be weak to fire if they're, um, if they're using, um, if they're using ice attacks like that. So let me use Maragi. Please land. Yeah, it works. Nice. Yeah, Yukari, <laughs> look, Yukari, Yukari knows that I can't, we've come too far to fail like this. Well, she wants this fight to get over with. But even killed the enemy too, that, that co-op attack. Alright, finally, this fight's over. Alright, Shuffle Time. Yeah, I've been getting lots of experience from Shuffle Time, and I also have lots of money now from both Shuffle Time and from the chess. Here, I'll show you how much money I have. Like, I'm getting, like, yen in the tens of thousands. Hey, Santi leveled up. Nice. Okay, wait, let me show you. I have 349,000 yen. That's, like, dude, that's a lot of money. Alright, anyway, um... Yep, yeah, that's her. Don't want to... Okay, so we've rescued this person. Awesome. Oh, wait a second. Wait a minute. There's another person that needs to be rescued, but we can rescue them in the... Yeah, we can rescue them in the next video. As long as I don't forget. Because if I forget and they turn into a wasp, that's going to be very, very bad. Alright, today's the last day off before uh, school resumes. The Autumn um, Equinox, and today's gonna be the day-long film festival as well. Alright. Hey, this is Kisuke. Do you have time to talk right now? Okay, hold on, before- oh, dang it. Dude, dude, before I even continue the dialogue, I love this button- this button-up shirt right here, and I want it. This button-up shirt is dope. Yeah, per characters in Persona 3 have a good fashion sense, I'll give them that. And I have Kusi Matama as well. Iwutode Strip Mall, the Beef Bowl Shop. You're out having a good time um, with, with Kisuke. I misread that line, I know. I've seen this before on a commercial, but it looks so good on a person. I mean, in person. 
That was the first time I ever be ate beef. Uh, ate a beef bowl. I didn't expect it to taste that good. Kisuke is even more excited. My parents always told me I should never put anything over rice. Their rules are so annoying. We would never have beef bowls at home. Uh, let's eat here again. Yeah, let's come here again. Just give me a call. Anytime. It's getting dark out. You return to the dorm. Where have you been? I've been with... <laughs> I love... I love... Alright, so if you play as... um, I think... Uh, I love... Okay, so I can't get my words together. I think if you play as Minako... I've never played as Minako before. I think you might have Akihiko as a social link. So if you have Akihiko as a social link and you hang out with him and you return, he'll still say, Where have you been? <laughs> it's hilarious. Okay, uh... Hey, Kutsuki-san's here. Nice. Are you feeling any any better, James Kuhn? I thought I was going to inquire earlier, but I thought you might be sick of everyone asking if you're sick. Oh, you can be a total jerk in this game. I'm fine, thanks. That is good to hear. Please take care of your jokes. Ah, chew! Uh, did I give him the sickness on accident? Hey, yo, Ikutsuki, you might want to stay away from me. Kind of ironic coming from the guy that gave him uh, whatever uh, whatever illness I had. Alright, let's go back to my room and then we're going to study. Yeah, let's go. Decided to study. Hey, we're back in school and then it's going to be another day off. Good morning. It feels like fall since the typhoon passed, doesn't it? <sighs> I hope the fighting ends before winter comes. I'm sure it will. I hope so. Hey, a lot of people are concerned about stress today. Believe it or not, crying can relieve stress. The tension is washed away with all those tears. But if the root cause of the stress isn't addressed, it'll become a vicious cycle. This is true, by the way. Yeah, to all my viewers out there, uh, on a serious note, take care of your mental health. Anyway. By the way, does anyone here know the number one cause of stress? No. No, no, no. Let's, let's stay up. Let's stay up. For men, it's their job. For women, it's their husband. Men get stressed from dealing with their bosses, co-workers, and so on. When they seek comfort at home, it passes on to their wives. They, in turn, relieve their stress through personal hobby. That's how a successful marriage functions. You stayed up and listened to the... Okay, so is she like a mental... Like, does she teach uh, social sciences or something? I wonder what she teaches. All right, everyone, quiet down. Um, there will be no classes this afternoon. However, that doesn't mean you get to, you're, you'll get you be allowed to goof off. You'll all have to work together to clean up the displays and decorations for the school festival. I'll assign you into three groups for their cleanup. The first group will, will go to the science lab. Your leader will be... Afternoon classes were canceled, and you'll be cleaning up after the school festival instead. All right, the school festival is here. Gekko Khan High School and the science room. You will be cleaning up with Kenji, Kazushi, and Yukari. Come on, let's hurry up and get this over with. Yeah. Yep. You all, you began cleaning up with everyone. Hey, this is the photography club's display. Aren't these pictures from the big competition? Look, James, you're in this one. Whoa, isn't this the guy that, um, uh, isn't the guy who took this kind of dark looking? He looks kind of like, he, look, he looks like he's got a bad suntan or something. Oh boy. <sighs> Okay. Whew. Okay, I'm going to let that one slide. That's Mamaru. She's crazy strong. Though of course I'll beat him one. Dude, I think you've uh, I, you've already. Dude, I think you've already taken the sweatiness competition. I've never seen you in the school uniform before. I guess jerseys are better stuff like this, but still. Hey, you guys can jabber all you want, but work while you talk. At this rate, we'll be here all day. Yukari piped up, sounding annoyed. Oh, so sorry. Hey, you're not like... What do you mean? I brought the stuff. Nail puller, tape, and... As for the drill, I have one built in. Junpei and Igus have arrived. It seems they've gone to get... Um, they'd gone to get the cleaning supplies. Cool. Thanks, man. Wait, hang on. Did you forget about the popping stuff? Popping stuff? Oh, the bubble wrap. Uh, good call, Kenji. Go get it. You know where, you, where they keep all the stuff, right? Well, yeah, but you're the one who forgot it. Huh? Are you sure? You really don't want to go? That place is like paradise, you know? You know that? Some fine chicas there who'd just be, who'd just, who'd be just your type. Well, wait, are you serious? Be right back, guys. Yeah, like I'd fall for that, dumbass. What kind of... Oh! oh my god. <laughs> 
Oh! <laughs> anyway, what kind of supply room is stocked with hot babes? Ahem. I asked all I asked you all to hurry up so we can go home. Oh, well, sorry, Yucatan. I am sorry that my mic fell. She's like a pissed off samurai. I heard that. Jeez, are you stupid or something? More like stupid, I think. Deja vu, I have been in this place before. Anyway, uh, I'll go to the supply room later. But yeah, it's a real shame the school festival fell through. There were so many cool events I was looking forward to, like a stand-up comedy show. They said it was going to be an open mic, so I was planning on trying it out. Whoa, really? With who? You. Dang. Wait a sec, you gotta let me in on plans like that. Dude, it was just a joke. It was gonna be Kazushi. Who, me? Hell no. Jeez, you guys are harsh. Can't any of you take a joke? James, then. Bring it on. Now that's the spirit. You wanna give it a little try right, right here? Your classmates and, and your cleanup group have gathered. Ahem, ahem. Hello out there, everyone. We're, we're the famous comedy duo, Kenji Tomashika. A duo of one. Hey, this is going pretty well. Man, now I can't wait for the real school festival. It's already over, idiot. What, are you giving up already? All you gotta do is sleep 360 more times, right? You know what they say, early to bed, early to rise. Makes you an old geezer? There you go, a great gag like that ends on a high note. Are you related to some chairman I could mention? Hey, speaking of jerks, here's a good one. What the, this key isn't working. Keep trying. <laughs> That's the lamest joke I've heard in years. You're a GeckoCon student through and through. I mean, come on. Well, I think that went pretty good, considering we didn't rehearse. Man, what a waste. Uh, it's pretty good that Kenji was able to do that on the fly. I, I like it. People that are able to do stuff like that on the fly are really, really talented. And I have nothing but respect for people who can, who can do stuff like that, um, like, with just without thinking. Hey, you know what else is a waste? We never got to see Yukari-san in her maid outfit. Uh-huh. Ugh, so word got around about that. I'm relieved it never happened. But I bet lots of guys were really disappointed. Right, Kazushi? Uh, really? Uh, what's a maid? A pure soul. Oh, it's something that guys like Junpei dream, dream about. Junpei. W wait a second, what's that look for? You look like I did something. Junpei-san, even I guess is disappointed in Junpei. You gotta be kidding. You too, I guess? Alright, that was pretty fun. Class has ended for today. Alright, this is a perfect place to stop. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this episode of Let's Play Persona 3 Portable. There's gonna be more on the way, so stay tuned. You guys stay safe and have fun.